Hello guys, welcome to my channel, The Office Guy Tutorial. So this is the part two video of my tutorial, how to make a dashboard in PowerPoint. So if you have not watched part one video, I would suggest you to first go and watch the part one video first. Without any further ado, let's start. So here is a slide which we have where we left last time and we have done, uh, we have prepared a basic UI here, username which you can add at any time. And the slide one, it can be named anything and this animation. For this part of tutorial, we are going to see how we can animate these graphs. So you can see how these graphs animate. So I'm quickly going to tell you how you can do, but I'll not be telling you how to make these graphs just to save the time. In case you are interested to know how to make graphs in PowerPoint, comment down below. I'll definitely make a video soon. So to start first, I'll take a rectangle. I'll draw a rectangle of roughly dimension and I'll reduce this to some small value. Just reduce this. Just make it roughly because we will be going to adjust later. I'll make a duplicate of this. Again duplicate. In case you don't know how to make a duplicate, you have two options. You can either press Ctrl D to duplicate and drag it and again press ctrl d so you'll get the same copy again again i'll press all these three select i'll select i'll select these three and press ctrl d again and i'll adjust it here so i'll just quickly copy all these graphs here so that we can save a bit of time ctrl c to copy and ctrl v to paste so here we have all the graphs. Now we need to adjust these boxes which we have drawn to match so that they will be in the limit of this box. Nice. So quickly adjust. So here we go. So now if I come to the slideshow, you can see there is no animation on this. So to add animation, it's very simple. Click on the graph, come to the animation and make it fade. And in the effect option, you make it by category. So now you can see one, two, three. So it comes is in the stages. Similar goes here also fade effect option by category so you will see it's animation so you can see it animating same goes here also here i'll make it flow i make it fly in but not the entire thing by series or what you can do i'll choose this make it fade by series so you can see you have a graph animation so that's all for this tutorial if you have any feedback or uh, if you want any specific tutorial do let me know comment below and let me know what i can do for you thanks for watching this video